Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to make a donut without sprinkles in uh, Blender 2.67. First of all, we're going to enlarge the cube by pressing S and making it a little bigger, switching it from texture mode to wire mode, like this. And now I'm going to add a mesh torus and I'm going to say 50 for major segments minor segments also 50 and i'm going to change the minor diameter to 0 0.5 pressing s to an enlargening it a little bit and put it right in the center of the box uh, i'm go going to call that one donuts right there um Control D and then Z, Z to just move in the Z direction. And this I'm going to call fluid chocolate, like that. And everything is ready for the chocolate simulation. Uh, I'm choosing fluid and this is the fluid don't change anything about this one we're going to donut uh, choose fluid and say this is the obstacle where we don't want any partial slip like this cube fluid and i'm selecting domain uh, i switch fr from resolution because i want a better view to 75 in the preview also and we I'm going to fluid world where I'm changing the viscosity into 5 and the exponent also 5 now everything is ready and I can start bacon press the bacon button and you see on top of the screen that the fluid simulation is already started Depending how how much or how high your resolution is, the higher your resolution, the longer the baking time is. So, meaning that the fluid simulation will take much more time. You see already on the screen the first step in the simulation. Why? Because I'm standing at position 1. I can go to 2, 3... And you already seen what he has already done in simulation mode. At a certain point you will see okay, this is already finished. Uh, in here I'm too far because he has already still to calculate that one. So go back and wait a little bit. And like this 18 is done. So I'm going to go out for a time and then come back when the simulation is a little further. Thank you. Hello everyone, I'm back. The simulation is uh, much more further and I think this is uh, looking okay. So uh, if you come back, you'll see what's happening. Uh, you see, at position, I think, 30. Over here, this is nice. So I can stop the simulation by pressing stop button. Yeah. And now I'm going to the cube tool and say, OK, apply. I'm going to donut, also apply. I'm going to fluid, also apply. The fluid chocolate I don't need anymore, so I'm going to delete it. This, uh, first of all, I'm going to select the right mouse click and then delete. And this is gone. Uh, now I'm going to delete all the vertices that I don't need. So I'm selecting cube with a little button. And I'm switching from object mode to edit mode. Right click on the... So I want to delete that one by pressing B. Left mouse drag to the right. Leave it. And you will see that not everything is selected. This is because... Go back again by right click on the mouse. This is because of this button. This only selects the visible parts, so press this one, yeah. B again, and select everything you want. You see that now everything is selected. Press delete 
vertices and it is done so if we now look carefully uh, it looks rather nice but it is very difficult to see if it is okay or not okay so i'm going to go to block and switch to solid mode switch to object mode and the first thing we're going to do is smoothness i'm going so also the donut has to be smooth like this okay we select cube again and now we're going to sculpture mode and we're taking this one f smooth and we enlarge the strength to one the only thing that we're going to do now is clean it a little further up and uh, yeah, it's probably better that we put some color in first because uh, when you put some color in you will see much more so i'm going to select material and i'm going to call it chocolate and i enter the hex code for chocolate is 86604d and over here the hex code is 8c7266 and meanwhile we're going to put some material in the donut also something like that and we're going to stick it if we render you will see directly how it's looking it's looking rather nice but the chocolate is not uh, the color is good but the chocolate is not okay so we switch back again to the 3d view and we're going to change it a little bit now we're back at sculpture mode the thing we're going to do is clean it a little up like this and we follow the shape a little bit like this there's things that not they are not belonging we do clean up like that we show We do the same on the interior. And now we can smoothen it a little bit. Uh, in here you have the diameter of your brush. So for instance, if you want a large diameter, it's like this. Uh, I'm taking uh, one around 50 and you can also switch the and these will close uh, if you have some time you will close some gaps or make some gaps and uh, that's normal because this the vertices underneath has to be smooth and it, it will take some time uh, it's not that easy in two seconds to explain and, and uh, you will see what's happening you have to go back then to the other one also to okay this is looking really nice this one is not okay so we go back to the other one and clean that one a little bit more up like this uh, and smooth it back again you have also the, the possibility of adding a little bit texture to it like that with this one that raises a little bit like that okay this is looking rather nice okay the interior also so i think that we have a perfect donut so we're going to render it and I think it's uh, looking rather nice. Thank you for watching uh, this tutorial. I hope you like it and please like my channel. Thank you for watching.